Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're all having a good one. We are back again. Move the mic just a little bit. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Hello, Kick. Hello, Twitch. Hello, YouTube. Whew. Okay. Well, let's see what we got. Uh, we got almost 50,000 favor. <sighs> Not unusual. Let's see. Let's see, we are gonna want rings with attack speed, at least tier six. Yeah, we're gonna want rings with attacks, uh, throwing attack speed, health. I got poison resistance there, okay. So if I lost both the rain and the shield, I would still have it. Interesting. Right, because this particular ring gives me necrotic resistance. Okay. So if I can make up my necrotic resistance elsewhere. Interesting. All right, well, let's... Let's go spend some favor chat. <sighs> Hope you're all having a good one. Man, it was really weird not streaming yesterday. It was really weird not streaming yesterday. Because I figured we wouldn't get back to the house until like later. And we ended up getting back to the house around 5. I normally go live at 6 p.m. Pacific. So, I was like, what? <laughs> I'm like, no, just commit. <laughs> you already said you're not going to stream. Just, just relax. I'm like, what is this relaxing? <laughs> All right, so Rax released a video today. Hey, what up, Air Dragon? How's it going? R Rax released a video today. Or was it yesterday? Rax released a video saying, hey, this is like the best way to uh, get stuff. I've personally been a big fan of just blocking out those other activities, but he's saying... Run one of these, run one of these, and then, you know, the focus that you want. Yeah, let's, let's take that one. Arena Tier 3. Emperor of Corpses. Yeah, we can go... We don't really have to farm the Emperor of Corpses, but that could be interesting. Let's just go with that one. We want better rings. Okay, kill Jura Tier 3 a couple times. Sure, I'm sure we're going to have to slam something at some point. 14 unique rings for doing tier 4 arena. I might actually have to go do... Oh, 18? Oh, that one... Sh like, I need new rings. Okay. Temporal Sanctum 3. Man, I think we almost burnt through... We just about burned through all of our favor. Okay. Maybe Rax is onto something. That that is a ton of rings. 
Welcome on in, everybody. That was your day today, Air Dragon. here let's run some let's see if we can't push the corruption just a little bit we're at 457 with smite hammers we do need new rings we just bought some prophecies so we gotta go do dungeons cool gotta kill rare enemies for 18 rings and that's gonna get oh my god this is gonna get doubled this is insane. Oh. Well, let's plug into the loot filter. Let's add a new rule. We're, we're item type. We're looking for for rings, obviously. We're just gonna plug in rain. Add a new condition affix. Hey, what up, Christian? Bob? Okay, what up, Bob? Throwing. We want throwing attack speed. We want throwing attack speed. Do we want any rain with throwing attack speed and health on there? Yeah, let's let, let's look for rings with throwing attack speed and health. I believe it's just increase uh, added health. With at least those two affixes, more equal to tier six. Yeah. And, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And we want. We, well, let's make it a color. Let's make it a light. Let's let's make it kind of like a, a purplish looking color. I I said recolor. Confirm. Update. There we go. How you doing today, Christian? You having yourself a good one, sir? shield charge but sometimes oh my I was like trying to move quickly and then I like clipped a pillar and then I just stopped hello from Tennessee <laughs> hey you're on a trip right now Tim way to go man hope you're enjoying Tennessee back here hamster uh black we, we don't care about that we'll, we'll take the ballista ones had to see some family grinding though that's what i'm talking about man Just die. Huh. 
Uh, uh, no, no. Plus four ring of shields, sure. <laughs> Am I ever going to use it? Probably not. <laughs> hey, hello again, Christian. Thanks for stopping by, Tim. I appreciate it. You enjoy your trip. Hope you get to see some family. Okay. Okay. Opinion on your PFP. What, what's what's PFP stand for? Personal fitness physician? Your personal friend, Paul. Profile picture. Oh, that makes sense. Uh, it looks... I mean, I'll see if I can't expand it. It kind of looks like a white circle with, like... Almost looks like a donut. like a damn duck and a donut like from here just, all i see is a white circle and it looks like a, a center <laughs> i i can't see what's in the middle you got you gotta like on my screen my chat box is not very large uh yeah i'll, I'll work on zooming in <laughs> You need to make a high well i the the original picture you found for me air dragon was pretty large we had we had to make it small for to make it into a um emo This is 457. Yeah, that the enemy's kind of hurt. Okay, let's Is that like some sort of yeti ghost, Christian? Wait, I can go to your channel. Oh, there, there. What, what the frick is that thing? A lot bigger here. Damn. Okay. Oh, I was like, Rinda G follow? No, Rinda G resubscribes. So do you like? Uh, I, I have no opinion. I have no idea what it's supposed to be. Want to make it micro 16K? Like that tiny little image is like a one gigabyte image file just to make computer strain under the awesomeness of Sparky. I got you. Uh, I have no opinion, Christian. I, I have no idea what it's supposed to be. Thanks for resubscribing, Rinda. I appreciate it. Seven months. It's a close-up of a Yeti face. From what? Like doing this in someone's internet connection, a game. 
Yeah, but what game? Roblox. Oh my god. It, it's it's taken over. There's rings all I'm not gonna be able to click anywhere soon. These prophecies have to be controlled. These prophecies must be stopped. Ah, oh, yes, Racksmith at very focused farming. Yeah, apparently he released that video. I was like, oh, let's give it a shot. What, what, what what's the harm? Yeah, I'm getting ballista rains out the wazoo. I'm just going to take all of them because you, you never know, chat. I mean, we got some health ones. Is that a T7 health? Oh, that's a T6. Do I have a Discord? Is that what you mean? Yeah, my Discord is public. Link's in the description, Christian. YouTube does not let dis. What, what are you talking about? Okay. Here, let me, let me pull out the link for you. There, there's a link to my Discord server. Keep it civil. WWF 80s cage match civil no ladders though
Oh, no, 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 not today, bub. <laughs> they tried to torch my ass. They're like, yo, barbecue on aisle five. And I said, nope. <laughs> uh, I really need... Uh, I learned how to hit someone with a folding chair at gym. Best thing I've ever learned. <laughs> Okay, let, let, let me see if I can't open up my... Okay, cool, cool. So is that the Yeti that you're talking about, Christian? That you you that's your profile picture? Looks a little bit different. Alright, cool. Yeah, I was like, that looks a little different. sent the right picture okay I'll, I'll check it out Oh, the same Yeti, just a different face? Got it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, here we go. Gives a whole new meaning to the song Thunderstruck. <laughs> see what you're talking about what the actual frick I think it's hideous oh my god Christian what the uh, right push the corruption yes we can uh, let's see hmm all right, let's go. Let's go fight. Let's go fight Birdman. It's time for you to become full-time Poe streamer in three days. Oh yeah, because the new league launches. We'll miss you, Slocky, but I'm not going over to Path of Exile. I already know it's gonna consume you. So I mean. Now, try and come up for air every once in a while, and if you do, think of us. <laughs> Jay Wody. I got kind of distracted. I was like, Jay Wody on Twitch? Normally over here on YouTube. 
I'm fine with it. By all means. I'm at work for another hour or so on the P. Yeah, I gotcha. Oh my god, he tried to fake me out. So, do I like your profile picture? It's freaking hideous once you see the full thing. But yeah, sure, your profile picture's fine. All right, Mr. Birdman, I need you to drop for me the Eternal Eclipse. Can you do that? Can you make it LP as well? Oh, no, 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 not today. Not today. Not today. Do you deny it? Yes, I do deny it. You're going to die. No! Did you know that this boss right here was responsible for some of the most player deaths in the game? Number one was Lagon. Number two was somebody else. I, I don't even remember. I was like, what? But then it was Raye. Like, makes sense. If you, if you don't know this dude's moveset, I mean, like, even I, who knows his moveset, like, sometimes I'll take a hit, and okay. Sometimes I'll take a hit, but I could survive a hit from this guy. Come on, Raya. Oh, my God. Chat, he dropped the sword. How did your doc's visit go with the missus? It was over, like, <laughs> it was over so quick, apparently. Like, I was still at work, and it was already done. And so, I got off work, went and picked her up. And, like, we got home, and we were home, like, after picking up dinner and all that, we got home at 5 o'clock. I go live at 6. And I'm just like, I, I, I look over at my wife, I'm like, what do I do? I'm like, I already told everybody I'm not going to. I already told everybody I'm not going to, to stream. And she's like, don't stream. And I'm like, this is weird. <laughs> it went well. Ah, oh, no LP. Oh, my gosh, man. Oh, of course, Dark Shroud of Cinders has LP. Bro called it a donut. Now thinks it's a horrifying yeti. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I did say it was a donut. I I did say it was a donut. Well, Jay Wody, these are your emotes. Do you stream?
Yes, sir. Those are mine and not anymore, though. Oh, you're still an affiliate. I got you. Th those look cool. All right, so Jay Wody, how did your doctor appointment go? If you're willing to talk about it. I used to, then I got a job and work crazy hours. Yeah, I got you. I got you. I can, all, I can only stream because my... I can only stream because my job has very reliable hours, and then my wife supports me in terms of streaming. Like, she, she backs me up. She, she helps with keeping the house tidy and everything so I can focus on streaming. That's the only way. I, I, I couldn't be a functional adult, work my full-time job, and then, then stream. <laughs> uh, not good? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Were, were they able to... Like I don't know what you're willing to talk about on online. If you if you just want to leave it at not not good, that's absolutely fine. You sent another one. Oh. Opinion on that. It, it looks like a, 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 a Mentar Yeti. A Minotaur Yeti. Let's just say I got the news I expected. I don't care. I'm in the middle of a very bad flare-up. I have roughly 10... Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, bro. Ooh, I'm sorry to hear that, man. And they're not able to do anything for you? Okay, so if we go down here... Then we can go do, we can go do a 12 bomb, a 12 slam LP. Cosentix. I've heard of Cosent. I've, well, I don't really know what it does, but I, I saw the, the, the ads. That picture is the mom of the yeti that's your profile picture i got it okay so that's what a full-grown minute uh that's what a full-grown yeti in that game looks like huh christian In four months uh here i'll A mighty apocalypse play, cool. No, 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 no flambe, no, no flambe, no, no, me, no likey. You had to fight that with a shotgun. Roblox is an amazing game. <laughs> yeah, I took it down with a shotgun. <clears throat> about uh, about a twelve grain. <laughs> Smokeless powder. Got a hair trigger on that puppy. All right. Four months. If they can't get it back under manageable conditions, they're going to send me to the... Oh to the hospital i'll probably join some trials man i'm sorry to hear that hopefully you can get get under control there we go chat if this works we're near 500 corruption Can we tank this? Yeah! 
Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I should have run away, man. Dude, there goes three gazes that we lost. Oh, let, let's go fight that dude again. I, I, I didn't know if we can tank that. I didn't know. We were close. I also hate fighting Orbis with his build because he's so freaking skinny. There we go. Now we're actually getting some hits. Also depends on what kind of Orbis you get, right? Oh, we have no potion. Uh, sucks. Okay, there we go. And you did. Holy great, Scott. What? I almost had a ton of prophecies. What do we got here? Is there any 2LP Titan Heart? No, there isn't. Take that. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, that's a great relic. Look at that. It's already got frailty, critical strike multiplier, critical strike chance. Perfect. Oh, again. It's life I expected the bad news. I, I'm I guess you're right. Like when you've already lived with what you've lived with for this long, you you just you, you learn to learn to deal. Oh, I kinda wanna take this helm. Oh man, it's got reduced channel costs, health health already on there i have to take that i mean i highly doubt i'm gonna be running i i highly doubt i'm gonna be running warpath this cycle but nonetheless that that's expect the worst you won't get down and you might be pleasantly surprised yeah that makes sense well so chat we had three gazes of orbis and it was a plus 12 to corruption. And then we died because we tried to tank Orbis. So we lost all the gazes and we only increased the corruption by 12. We're at 469 corruption. Uh, we could probably pump that number up again. I'm sure. I, I think the build can handle it. I, I think around 500 corruption will probably be like... Eh. You know, maybe getting close to 600 corruption, we'll, we'll, we'll start to feel it. We'll have to min-max it some more, but so far the, the build's feeling pretty, pretty strong. Looking for a couple more min-maxed. We could, uh, so what areas of improvement? Uh, the wand could possibly be improved i mean there's always improvement everywhere but the shield's pretty close
Hey, so if you're watching right now and you're interested in seeing a build guide on this video, leave a comment and I might I might be able to make one. We've been playing it for how long we've been playing this one? Not like okay, so we played Paladin for the first two weeks of the cycle, but I think we only played this build for a couple days. It, it wasn't super hard to set up. We did min-max it a little bit. Uh, if you're over on YouTube or if you're over here on Twitch, if you're interested in the build, uh, I do... There is a build guide for it from Max Roll. I put the link there just because, you know, this is where I got the idea. I've, I've added my own little spin to it, but if, if you're interested in trying this build out for yourself, you can use the build guide I followed. Uh, like I said, link in the description or link uh, build command on Twitch. This is a lot of fun, though. I'm not going to lie. This is a lot of fun. Yeah, our most recent build guide, the Squirrels build, I didn't know how people were going to react to that, seeing as it wasn't really my my build. I followed a build guide, but then I realized, you know what? There's probably a market out there for people like, okay, how realistic was that build guide? Like, how close did you get? I think I think there's a market for that. Because a, a lot of those build guides that you see out there, it'll be like set up the most min max way possible and it's like okay how close can somebody get to that in a realistic time period so i think there's a market for that i i'd say that this banner right here is near perfect the only thing the only thing i mean obviously you can go for a t7 smite a t7 smite tier six is fine but we got a t5 critical strike multiplier a t5 health i would prefer 75 health but 57 it's on the low end oh well but it's still a t5 the frailty we were on our way there this is near mid maxed shield is pretty close to t7 block chance decent amount of block effectiveness what, what's that put us at 2535 block effectiveness builds a ton of fun yeah that, that makes sense jay wody you expect the worst and then you know what you might be pleasantly surprised Yep. Hey, what up, Space Trucker? How's it going, man? How you doing? What you been playing? Yo, how's Dragon's Dogma? That way, I, I remember now. That's what, that's what you were playing. You had some time off for that. Like, did you beat it? Get deleted. Oh, whoa, 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 before I leave, what? No, no, I did not beat it. I'm really slow with the open world games. I like to take my time, but I'm loving it. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad you're having a good time. So
Speaking of, oh, the suspense. It's tangible. There's a mod out there that fixes the frame rate? Really? They were able to fix it with a mod on PC? Number one question everybody's going to ask. Why couldn't the devs have done that? <laughs> if somebody is able to make a mod for it in less than a week... Thought you couldn't mod it because of DRM? Maybe it already got cracked. Honestly, I think that's what's causing it. It's the DRM on the game. Twenty percent block. Okay, you know what? Uh, I think the the implicit block chances a little low. Well, it does come with 75% poison resistance already on there, like as an implicit. They made a DLSS frame generation mod that doesn't fix the issue, it just adds frames open. Official frame gen, gen is causing. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm very unfamiliar with all of that. Thank, thanks for the, the insight, Kinjara. Oh, I see. So the issue is a bit more complex. Yeah, I'm like, there's something funky about that. If somebody was able to just make a mod like that and fix it. So it's helping, but it's not like actually fixing it. That, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, whoa, 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 what? What? Is that a max chance to shred? Damn near. Dude, this is a massive upgrade. I mean, honestly, I don't want to give up any block effectiveness. How much do we lose? We lose a... a, a we do lose some. Yeah, I, I'm gonna keep that one there for now. That 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 was a that was a fat upgrade. Oh, that that like that that this is legit. Oh, this is legit. Root of the issue is that when you're near a town, the amount of logic happening on the CPU is bogging it down so far that it takes longer for the CPU to send a frame to the GPU. The longer the delay, the worse the FPS drop. It's why your CPU gets smashed in towns, but when you're out of town, the CPU is fine, so your CPU is no longer the bottleneck. They lost villages due to it? Dragon's Plague? Kind of crazy. With minimal spoilers, Capcom added a mechanic that if players ignore, it literally nukes your city and kills a ton of NPCs, important and non-important. Dang. I mean, I personally don't have any interest in playing Dragon's Dogma, but somebody else might be here. So yeah, yeah. Minimal. Let's keep the minimal spoilers. I don't want to ruin it for somebody else. They need to have a freaking occlusion for non on screen polys on top of the CPU issues with every NPC taking up resources. I mean, that's probably what it is. If the NPCs are really robust, I mean, that, uh, that's going to tank your CPU. That's going to tank your CPU. You got to develop all that logic, all those scripts that they got to follow. And that's me speaking as a layman. I'm an. I'm pretty sure all CP, uh, all NPC behavior is dictated by your CPU, not your your GPU. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. 
excuse me. Can we just kill this guy already? Can you just die? Why do you gotta be so skinny? Ugh. Can't even scratch my nose. Freaking spires. I hate them. I hate them, but I love them. <laughs> Two-handed axe, probably nothing I'm interested in. All right, let's keep moving, folks. Hey, Wraith Lord's Harbor, 1LP, nice. Seventy-one percent chance to shred armor with throwing attacks. I mean, that's cool. I'll keep the block effectiveness. Uh, wait, you guys said a lot. Uh, it's actually the game is poorly optimized. Like, what were they thinking? Sending, seeing someone with a five K computer dip into thirty FPS frequently, I'd be pissed. Yeah, I have a decent CPU, so the FPS is not bad, but with my PC getting FPS drops is insane it's really bad it needs to be fixed what's a game without a bunch of issues in this day and age I don't think warning people about the mechanic is a spoiler territory I put it in PSA territory but in my opinion it's a shame because the game is actually amazing yeah I got you I got you true seems like you can resolve it but i don't know i think it's really interesting brave mechanic to implement love all the community engagement and making on reddit if you played dragon's dogma 2 and want to know more research dragon's plague okay i got you i got you okay i think i i, I think we're gonna skip that song <laughs> Actually, me and someone else were shooting a shotgun and still took a long time to kill the Yeti. All right, Christian. Wait, on to LE. I missed Sunday's stream. How's the Paladin going, Bike? It's going well. Like, we're... I mean, we're still sort of gearing for it, but it's... The gear I have is actually close to the, to the guide. It need... Like, the rings need to be looked at. I did an arena run. I made it to 
I, I was cruising. I was at wave 185. I completed wave 185. And then for whatever reason, my muscle memory was like, okay, the monolith's over. So I used the portal and left. And then I was like, oh, frick. I didn't have enough time to do another arena run. Uh, and then I didn't have a stream yesterday. Oh, wait, wait, one LP? I mean, I'll still take it. Give it to me. Did you guys see the Kingmaker trailer? No. What, what, what's the Kingmaker's trailer? Like, I know of the Pathfinder PC game. It, it's like a like an old school RPG, you know, like Baldur's Gate, like the original Baldur's Gate RPG, where you can like stop time, but it kind of operates in real time too. I, I know that Kingmaker. You're probably not talking about it. What? Okay, okay. I, I, I'm going to sit here and read what you just said. Because saying it out loud, I think, is something else. Did you guys see that Kingmakers trailer? I asked, what's that? It's a game where you go back to medieval times. Only you bring machine guns and trucks. What the actual flip? <laughs> okay, let's see if I can't turn this slightly down. You just posted it in my Discord. Okay, let's. Keenmakers official trailer. We'll have to check that out later. <laughs> I did see that. It looks crazy. Yeah, let's go back to medieval times. Also, we're going to bring all these machine guns. Yeah, that's a key maker right there. Whoever you give that technology to back then. Oh, Where you going, Rage? Uh, well, Jesus. 
Oh, okay. I mean, if you had an Apache in medieval times, you would not be a king. You would be a god. I'm not a king. I'm not a god. I am worse, man. I am so hyped for no rest for the... I'm looking forward to no rest for the wicked. I'll stream that game at least once. If it doesn't hook me, we go back to last epoch. But if it does, we, we, might, we might play through the entire thing. And I'm thinking it might hook me just because I, I do like Souls games. It is so hard. Have you played it, Air Dragon? Like, did you get into the... the Like, have you seen, like, enough... Of the, I haven't seen a lot of the footage, but did you, like, get into early access playtests? Because I know some people did. I played someone else's access. Oh. Oh, interesting. Is it really that difficult? Because I, I don't want to, like, have to come home on, on a weekday. <laughs> that, that might be a weekend game. I don't want to have to, like, come home after working all day and then, like, put on my tryhard sweat cap. No, 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 you're not killing me today. Was it like Dark Souls in the way that you could just pick, like, go somewhere, farm for, like, a long-ass time, and then just cruise? <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I've done that so many times at Dark Souls. Like, oh, hey, this place is a good farming spot. Stay there for, you know, <laughs> hours. Cruise through other parts of the game afterwards. <laughs> I, I, I'm pretty sure I've done that like every time I've played a Souls game. Oh, these enemies I give a lot of XP. I'll just stay here, you know, rinse and repeat. Kind of secret hyped about it. Found out they, they had access. I got murdered by normal enemies because I thought, hey, I'm tough enough to face roll them now. Okay, Air Dragon, I mean this in the most sincere way possible. Is it possible there was skill issues? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I, I had to ask the question. <laughs> I mean, probably not. You you play a lot of Path of Exile, all right? So, like, I, I just got to say... <laughs> I, just, I had to say it. Don't, don't hate me. <laughs> Confidence is the quickest kill. I mean, face rolling. <laughs> Playing with one and a half hands. Okay. Okay. I'm still going to go off the assumption it's hard or, or off the, the, the impression that it is hard. Still, I'm looking forward to it. I think No Rest for the Wicked will be great to at least, you know, play it once on the channel. Seems like a controller game. I mean, I do have a controller, so I can do it. I also watch Rax play it. He got murdered. Okay, okay. You're on to something. But I did enjoy myself. Hard, hard can be. Oh my gosh! Yeah, you set yourself up for that one, Air Dragon. <laughs> That's what she said. Hey <laughs> oh. Huh. 
back in a few. All right, see you soon, Jay Wody. That is what she always says, softly in my ear. <laughs> like, whoa, hey there, cowboy. Man, we just blasting today, guys. We're just blasting. Right, actually, we went and... Oh, my gosh. We're already back up to 30,000 favor. Dude, this is... This is nice. Maybe I should have st stuck with Paladin for a while before switching off to play other classes. Like, th <laughs> Imagine, like grinding through like 500 corruption building up like you know 500,000 favor and then just go into a new <laughs> go into a new class like all right go find what you need <laughs> bring out your dead <laughs> What did I get up to yesterday? I didn't stream yesterday. Rare, I know. Babbling bike missed a day of streaming. My wife had a doctor's appointment, so um, I thought it was going to take longer. Because I also thought I was going to get stuck in 5 o'clock traffic trying to get back. And uh, we were just like like the doctor's appointment went by super quick i got out there super fast uh picked her up got onto the highway traffic was starting but i was able to like the traffic didn't really start happening till a certain exit and you know you guys know i drive for uber in this area i'm like oh dude if we take this exit we take it to that road then we take it to that road we could get home in you know 12 minutes and we even had time to go pick up food through a drive-thru. And that's exactly what happened. <laughs> so I could have streamed, but, you know, I, I I committed to the fact that I already told you guys I wasn't streaming, and uh, that's what happened. <laughs> You've done daily streams since launch? Yeah, so since launch, I I had missed one stream. That was the week after launch. I had to take I I had so much to do, I had to take one day off. And then since then I have streamed every day. And then even before that, I was streaming every day. Uh so it, it doesn't happen all, since the beginning of the year. I think I've missed like three streams. I mean, it's it doesn't happen often. With well, yesterday being one of the three, I, I would have to go look at my streaming, you know, tracker or something. But because I used to not stream every day, but then. Um, 
Now, I told you guys I also drive for Uber. Well, Uber lately, like, I work full-time, and then I would drive for Uber on the weekends. Well, Uber lately is, uh, how shall we say, uh, crowded. There's so many drivers in my area now. Like, I don't even get rides. The The... <laughs> If I decide to go out and drive for Uber, like, the only thing that happens as a driver, we'll get a trip's radar. And that means there's a ride available in your area, but everybody in my area who's driving sees it too, and by the time I click on it, it's been claimed by another driver. Typically in the past, what would happen with, with Uber is they would be basically, you're in the area, they'd assign you a ride. And I started... Uh, during COVID because I was like, hey, good way to make some extra money. Plus, a lot of drivers left uh, Uber. And so I was like, I was doing pretty good. I was driving every night. I was like, yeah, this is lit. And then as time went on, you know, I started getting kind of tired because I was like, I was working full time and then driving every night. That was kind of putting a strain on me. So I was kind of backing off on that. Then I whittled it down to just Fridays and Saturdays because that was guaranteed money. And now even that's gone. So I've put a lot more focus on streaming. And my wife and I decided, hey, let's stream every night. And I've been able to keep it. I've been able to keep streaming every night. Plus, I mean, most people, like, like I would say 99.5% of the people I pick up are cool. But sometimes you just pick up that super drunk person or you, you like, you pick up somebody who's drunk and they're touchy-feely. And, and, and in my case, it's, it's the ladies. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Doesn't like I said, doesn't happen often, but sometimes it's like, hey, <laughs> and you're and you're you're trying to be nice because you know you're trying to get them home. They're they're intoxicated, and you're like, you know, hands to yourself. <laughs> uh, I I got a ton of stories. <laughs> That's the best thing that that I, I I've taken away from Uber. What, <laughs> I got a ton of stories, man. <laughs> On. And like I said, 99.5% of the time I pick up somebody, they just, they're chill, they just want to go home. You drop them off, they get out, end of ride, good time. It's that half percent of time. And then, it, like, and then, like I said, it, the rides are kind of drying up. There's just so many drivers in my area now. Everybody's trying to make an extra buck. Yeah, I, I did my taxes this year for Uber, and I actually reported a loss. For the first time, I've been doing it since 2021. So I was just like, yeah, gonna have to focus in other areas. Plus, I really enjoy this. You know, like, booting up, going live. Uh, I'll see guys like you, Space Trucker, Air Dragon, Christian. You know, everybody just jumps into the stream. Jay Wody. And, and we're all talking, having a good time, talking about our days. This, this is nice. This is relaxing. No, and then you get to meet new people all the time here. Yeah, for sure. For sure. You get to help people out. Sometimes they'll come by like, hey, I'm I'm, I'm doing this in last epoch. What's going on? Be like, have you tried this? What's that? 
then you tell them and they're like wow i didn't think of that thanks and that's just like that's a nice feeling you know oh you like the music thanks i mean it's not mine i'm just, it's from a company called stream tunes they do copyright free music I used to do different playlists when I streamed exclusively on Twitch, but now that I stream on both Twitch and YouTube, because YouTube, uh, Twitch has a thing where you could remove remove the music afterwards, but on YouTube that isn't there. So I've seen people who like stream on Twitch and YouTube, and they'll just play no music on YouTube, and I don't want you know somebody watching on YouTube to feel like a second class viewer, right? So I was like, instead of trying to figure out how to do that so I can keep my same playlist, I was like, nah, let's just, I mean, it's cool for the VODs too, because then the VODs actually have music and then everybody gets to enjoy the tunes. Didn't we, like, just do this map with the same exact objective just a little bit ago? <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this feels like deja vu, chat. Wait, we did. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> like, wait, didn't we just do this? <laughs> A little, a little deja vu didn't hurt anybody, right? Right. <laughs> Get wrecked, bird man. Oh, no, no, not today. No, sir. No service. Not today. Potions! Do you deny it? 
<laughs> like, get out the way now! Run! Duck and cover! Come on, man, you gotta drop the Eternal Eclipse sometime with LP, I must say. It's not gonna help this build, but you know, I'm always looking out for other builds, right? I want the Master Yi build to shine. Give me a four LP Eternal Eclipse. That's, that's asking for too much. That's asking for too much, chat. I already know. Oops. Gloves be a ravenous void. Oh no, that was that was asking for too much, right, chat? <laughs> ravenous void, please. Uh, let, let, let's see what kind of prophecies we got. Uh, temporal sanctum, uh, Orbis, temporal sanctum. Oh, okay. A lot of a lot of temporal sanctum. Well, well. Well, hold up. What else do I got on here? Uh, okay. That's never going to happen. Abandon that prophecy. Oh. Uh, might happen someday. Actually, do I really care about unique daggers? Get out of here. Might happen someday. Get out of here. Unique helmets. Again, might happen someday. 12 relics from arena arena tier two okay okay uh okay let's let's just keep farming okay Hey, no, 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 no touchy. You you cannot touch the armor clad warrior. Hey, hey, yo, oh, hey, 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 Oh man! Oh, that guy was like, <laughs> I touched it. <laughs> oh, and we gotta clear this to keep going. Darn! And we lose the we we lose the the bump.
Trans sword, be something good. Okay, another spine. I think I got like five of those in the bank. Alright, here we go. Let's keep going. Keep it going. Keep it going, chat. Oh, there we go. Catapult's tainted effigy. Sure. Nope, no ravenous void today. Is this literally the furthest we can go down? Because it looks like it's looping back up. We can start over here and head down that way. Let's go. Let's go, Chad. through too much mana uh, that's a statement you don't normally hear on a smite hammered in oh I burned too much mana <laughs> oops normally it's I haven't burned enough mana what am I doing Secret has been found. Later. Huh. 
what is going on here? Oh, yeah. Later. Hey, Marvel Man over on Twitch. How you doing today, man? How's it going today? Throwing damage. Yeah, I'm going to leave that. I'm going to leave that. Ooh. What are you up to today, Marvel? <laughs> you just sat down. Probably going to kick it on your Void Knight. That's lit. <clears throat> void Knight is lit. So even though I didn't stream yesterday, I did play. And I went and played on the Void Knight. <laughs> I went and did the Rive Healing Hands again. <laughs> Looking at it, I'm like, golly. I could see where I went wrong. I didn't even get all my grand blessings on that character. I was just like... <sighs> Normally, a build feels kind of, like, off unless you you have full grand blessings. And, like, half my blessings were normals just because the build was so, was so strong. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I spend, like, another couple weeks on it, that thing would be insane. Though I will say I was getting a little tired of the monotonous gameplay. <laughs> Lunge in, hold left click. It's dead. Move on to the next enemy. I mean, that's probably not fair to it. This build's kind of similar. Instead of lunge in, you, you run in with shield charge. Mighty Bracers. Later.
distract. Oh, okay, I butchered that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, chat. Please don't leave. <laughs> I could do the you ban. No, it actually comes to say thunderstruck. Everybody watch. <laughs> like, get out of here. Another plus four to vengeance, chat. T7s left and right. Another. Oh, that's a T7. Is it? Yeah, it is a T7. It's a max crit chance. Oh, we okay. We got to go at least slam this into an apathy. See if we can't get that to go over. I, I think I got a couple apathies left after our uh, slam train the other day. Terror Crown of Endurance, sure, why not? I got a feeling I'm gonna need it. One of these days. Give me all your favor. Show me your favor. Eight. Look at all these set items I'm not going to use. <laughs> oh, I can't. 25% oh. <sighs> increase health. Okay. What if we just, what if we do like a double Raye back to back? Let's, let's try, let's try the double Raye back to back. Try and get two. It gives us two back to back chances on getting a uh, Eternal Eclipse. I swear, I gotta be like the only player in the game looking for that sword. Everybody else has gotten it written off. Like, oh, Eternal Eclipse, that sword sucks. And I'm like, give it to me. <laughs> this entire cycle, I haven't been able to find. Haven't been able to find one. Well, I did find one with LP once. And I got the worst slam possible on <laughs> Well, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> no, I will. That, that was a terrible slam. Yeah. 
that's near max, right? Yeah, sure. Oh, is this the end of the road? It's a plus 12. Uh, no. We do not want that. This is not safe. Mighty Vanguard Boots, all right. <laughs> Actually, get rid of that. Get rid of that junk. I said get rid of it. <laughs>
Uh, okay, well, we can keep going down this way. We're getting close to that double Raya encounter. Oh, boy. Jeez, the game is like, what? We don't know what to do. There's too much going on. Twenty three FPS, dag gone. They got to address that. The devs got to address that. That's insane. I know they addressed the memory leak, and that helped in a lot of instances, but there's just sometimes there's just too much happening. This one's further down and it's a plus 10. Oh, okay.
Okay, let's do this one and then I think we'll be maxed out at 1600. Yeah, yeah. Got to farm just enough bonus stability. No flambe for you. Okay, I don't normally recommend this chat, but I am going to go look for other enemies. Normally I say just leave, go to the next one, but I'm trying to maintain the the modifiers that I have and and gain some extra stability. Okay, that should be enough. Uh, okay, what modifiers do we have still? Okay. Sweet. Frenzy and hit. Okay, that this this is good enough. We should be able to get two more stacks of Gaze of Orbis. Now the boss will be harder, but it should give a, a higher modifier for stuff.
Keep that. Where did it drop? It's already got health, movement speed. Nah, that's not a base I want. Jeez. Okay. All right. Second time's the charm. Let's go. Eternal Eclipse with some LP on it. I believe, chat. came to play Die to Raya? Yeah, yeah, that's that sounds about right, space trucker. I've killed this boss how many times and I die to him? <laughs> Dude, that one almost cooked me. I blocked it, but holy moly. Jeez, this guy is so stingy. I'm just thinking about when you read the stats on the first 30 days and Raye was top three most lethal boss. Almost bike. Yeah, almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Uh, yeah, almost, man. Dude, like we stacked up the modifiers like like we have a 503% increased item rarity drop right all right well let's go die to orbis <laughs> yeah. i mean this is gonna suck four stacks of gaze Oh, I have no potions. We must use all of them in the Rage fight. Why 
Why do you gotta be so skinny, right? Uh, Orbis? What? I think we could tank it. Apparently, we couldn't tank it. Damn, that was four stacks that we lost. Freaking Orbis, man. We're going to have to go to a different one because even if we go back and fight that same one, I mean, the gazes are gone, right? The gazes are gone, but even if we go back here, we get no stability. We're going to have to just go fight a different one. Damn. Uh, yeah, no, I don't have this one. Though, like, th this one is so hard to fight because it's all AoE. <laughs> Golly. What about this one? Jeez. Because sometimes you'll get an Orbis that you just absolutely smoke. Uh, poison. We'll just have to pay attention. Jeez. <laughs> okay, maybe I have to play that one without music? <laughs> God. I didn't even hear him say, here it comes. Golly. Yeah, I'm just going to have to go with no stability. Orbis has been a bitch. Don't. He didn't. Okay, this one's worse than the other one. Is this the best boss in the game? The 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 thing it's hard to prepare for Orbis because No, my favorite boss to fight is probably Raye. My least favorite is Elder Gaspar. The problem with Orbis is sometimes you get a favorable Orbis who you could fight super easy and then you get one where his his ability set like we could probably fight this one I was just not trying to face tank him Yeah, so what I tried to do last time with this particular iteration of Orbis is I tried to face tank him in that pile of goo. That, that, that pink stuff on the ground, that Pepto. Also kind of sucks because his... Um, He's skinny, so half my hammers are missing. Get out the way for such a skinny boss, like, sometimes. Yeah, there he goes. Like, I knew I could beat him. It's just... You can always check the Orbis first, then portal out. 
Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. I've actually never played it that way. Yeah, that, that makes sense, our shot. And be like, oops, these abilities don't jive with my kit. Bye. <laughs> I mess with you, bike. Haha, uh -huh. Orbis is annoying. I hate the void one. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, it's just so many different movesets. You're like, which one you're going to get? Our shot's on the right path, though. So instead of being well into 500, because we have four gazes of Orbis, we're 481. Uh, let's get the music back on. Uh, it's a little late for an arena run. Yeah, yeah. We could try an arena run. We we could. <coughs> Assuming I don't accidentally portal out. Oh, I'm a dumbass. Let's deposit all the keys. Or, 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 or. Let's try an arena run. And plot twist we trust. <laughs> What's up, Nighthawk? All through the power of plot twist. I shall save you, Delaga. Through the power of plot twist. <laughs> That night was too much fun. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun, Nighthawk. Dude, like, I swear, guys, I almost portaled out again. My muscle memory was going back to it. It's so peaceful to hop in here and support you while you play Epoch. I appreciate it, Nighthawk. Thank you. 
disable the portal keybind? No, I'm not going to do that. I just got to have some self-control, Space Trucker. The, the time I jumped out of the, the arena that time, that particular one had like a ton of loot drop right here, right? So it totally felt like I just completed an echo. And so then I portaled out without thinking about it. And I'm like, oh, dude, I was at almost 200 waves, you know? So I don't know why chat, but this map in particular in the arena, I have the highest, like, highest chance of death. Especially on hammers. Like, I don't know if you guys are seeing that. When my hammers hit that boat right there, that that overturned rowboat, they, they just disappear. So even at a lower wave count like this, if my hammers go away, there goes all my DPS. See, look, they're going through the boxes, right? But like, let's say I go to kill something over here, all my hammers just go away. But not the boxes. So I got to try and avoid that boat, but sometimes you just got to take out an enemy super quick. Like one of these guys. Like that that dude right there, right in the scarab. Like literally, I was cruising on squirrels. And one of, the, one of these fuckers hit me from off screen and one shot me. Their attacks are so strong, and it really sucked. It was off screen. I knew it was him because it was like the javelin hits, and then it explodes. Yeah, I'm playing as Thor. I I'm Thor. This is the Thor build. What's up? See, look. These pillars don't eat my hammers. I'm fine right here, but that map back there with the robo, it, it, it just it, it kills hammer builds. Freaking Gorgon? I hate Gorgons. <laughs> I absolutely hate Gorgons. Wow. We've cleared 219 waves with this build. I get killed at 140 to a freaking Gorgon. Such an overtuned. <laughs> they're 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 more powerful than they should be. They they not only do a massive amount of damage, they also apply a huge amount of poison. So I got bumped down to number nine. What the frick? Okay, so Drader here at level 96. See, like, there's... Okay, I respect this build. What was this dude doing? Was he just straight up using healing hands as the attack? Like, look, I'm the only character in the top 10. Well, me and Shimba Void are the only characters in the top. Well, no, 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 no. Lasanian are in the top 10 who don't use healing hands. Uh, and uh, I'm not bagging on anybody who's using healing hands, but right now, clearly it's the meta, right? Gorgon, Medusa, yeah. Clearly it's the meta right now. Man, this guy almost caught me right here using a Rive Healing Hands build, level 100, Vaith. Man, this guy, this guy almost bumped me down to number 10. Yeah, this is, um, if we want to climb up in the, in the top 10 some more, this is going to take some work, chat. And I may have to just end up ditching smite hammers i might have to go nova hammered in or if i can ever find 
I don't know. We're like, we might be able to pull it off. I got an Apathy's Maw with Critical Strike Chance on it now, so I could fire up the Master Yi build again. It'd probably be more like the Jax build, but... But yeah, we do have an Apathy's Maw now with, with melee crit crit strike on it, like a T6. That would be funny if I could use that build and, and like hit the top three. <laughs> that would be funny. Like everybody's running like healing hands and whatever. Here's a paladin running void cleave. Like what the frick? I mean, honestly, my best shot is probably Nova Hammered in, just because I also got a ton of gear for it. I got, I got a ton of gear. I can make Nova Hammered in work really easily. Because the one problem with Smite Hammers is some character models are just, like, skinny. And sometimes they just miss. Whereas Nova Hammered is you fire you fire hammers in a in a line, so it's really easy to line it up and, and take somebody out. And I really regret <laughs> I really regret like jumping out at 185 waves on Sunday. I was just super unfortunate because like we were cruising. Okay, next time we see a Gorgon chat, we I'm going to have to just go absolutely ham and cheese on his ass. I cannot give him a, an inch. Dude, these walls right here, they're eating my hammers, too. Okay, Gorgon time. There we go. Of course we want to keep going. Of course we want to keep going. Let's go. Oh, these walls are killing my hammers, too. That's... Oh. 
Tim Tartar Ways. Name of the game. New map, get us off this map. Get us off this map, chat. Can't find my mouse. There it is. Can you? Can you die? Can you bleed? <laughs> Hammers seem strange. Yeah, sometimes they just get eaten by the, the walls and stuff. And then just some models, like some character models are just kind of skinny, so you just miss. Get me off this map and let's go to another one, chat. Let's go.
Just go, 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 go. <laughs> I'm behind you. Where are they at? Where are they at? Oh, this has got to be like a slow enemy. Where, where is he at? This better not be something that just one shots me from off screen. Oh, uh, am I missing something here, chat? Did my game just bug out? Oh, what the? Okay. So many McHammer jokes, yeah. <laughs> or MC Hammer. You I'm pretty sure you met MC Hammer. How's it going, A? Oh my gosh. Next map, let's go. that chat we found them oh I am out of mana that I could be dead uh, hold, hold hold up I'm not dead Keep it going. <laughs> Did 
bitch. <laughs> Satisfying. I only got 55% endurance on this guy. Interesting. Okay. Attempt harder waves. Here we go. I was not going to let those guys try and, you know, torch my ass. I can't move. What the frick is going on? Okay, that was weird. That was like a ton of input delay. I don't even know what is happening anymore, chat. What? Jeez. Uh, okay, okay. I, I, I think everything's responding now. I wonder if it's because I'm also streaming and trying to do this. Hope not. Try it out a Beast Lord build with Storm Crows. It's really good. Yeah, yeah. Beastmaster is hella strong. Sorry, Beast Lord is ever quest. I, pff, no worries here, man. All right. Well, we're getting close to our old record, chat. Our old record was 219. We're trying to beat that. Ravenous Void? No, I don't care. Let's go. Keep it going. My man, what up, dog? Hey, what up, Vincent? How's it going?
Sick build. Glad you like it, man. Yeah, Smite Hammers is is a classic, and it's a lot of fun. Pumped Pigeon, thank you for following over on Twitch. go chat moment of truth I have a smite palette feel, feel slow why does it feel slow like like movement speed sorry I'm getting close to beat my old record Vincent so I'm kind of hyper focused on this I'll try and check in with you uh in between um in between waves One LP Titan Heart. I'll pick it up. Uh, you good, man. Do your thing. You'll F around in the game. Okay. Uh, the link to the build I'm using is in the description over there on YouTube. Actually, I think I still got it copied. No, nope, no, that's my Discord. Never mind. <laughs> All right. shield rush why did you have to take a shit right there i almost died it like lagged i was holding the button down it was just oh my god oh, you gotta love this game chat there we go we beat our old record chat yeah, let's keep it going. We're, we're going back for the crown, boys. I die this round. <laughs> that that would that would track, though. Like, honestly, whenever I beat a record in the arena and there there it is. Oh my god, do some <laughs> fucking shield rush! I'm gonna have to swap it out! <laughs> Jesus, dude. you guys see that? I was literally just running in place with it, not moving! <laughs> when you need it the most, it fails! <laughs> it's too good! It's too 
god. Beautiful and sweet hammers. Oh god. Uh, I love this game so much. <laughs> I'm like, I'm getting beat up. I'm about to die. I need to shield rush out. Runs in place. <laughs> uh, how many do you have in this game? What it? What is the lightning? So beautiful. This is smite hammers for for paladin. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's too good, chat. Let's see if I can't go back and grab like a potion. Okay, let's let's get some of these going on. That would have killed me right there. But I sidestep it. Why? Because I got them moves like Jagger. Tracks. It absolutely tracks. That That's how you die in this game, man. That's... How many hours? Uh, 780? That 100% tracks. I don't think I moved up the leaderboard, but I gave myself a more comfortable position. I'm going to have to figure out something other than shield rush. I died like almost like, like there was three times I was almost dead. Yeah, so I didn't move up the ranks, but I gave myself more wiggle room. Oh, man, that, that is so disappointing. So we added plus 10. Yeah, because if we were able to do like another 30 waves, we'd be number four. Like we were so like the gap between me and number four is so low. The smite your plane has ward. So you're doing healing hands. So you're doing direct cast smite, Vincent. That's not what I'm doing. I'm doing smite hammers. So you're directly casting smite. Yeah. Yeah. So you're directly casting smite and Heal and it's applying healing hands with this build since i'm indirectly casting smite it doesn't apply healing hands so you're actually direct casting smite you're gonna want some like some some cast speed with that direct cast smite feels bad dude it's just so slow this is so fast because since your your hammers are casting the smite for you when they hit an enemy you just build up throwing attack speed and then you can ignore uh no we want this one because like right here if you really want like the smites to crit if you really want the smites to crit you got to take conviction what does conviction give you minus 25 percent cast speed right but i ignore that l L checks the ladder. Yeah, so if you're just tuning in, uh, we just did an arena run where, you know, just like every arena run, we got one shot by a mob that spawned out of nowhere. <laughs> uh, and we're still number nine, it, 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 depending on how long you've been here. I was number one at one point, but then I got knocked off. I was playing other classes. So I'm trying, I'm trying to climb back up the ranks. Everybody's using at least in the top, in the top 10, there's like me and like two other builds, maybe three other builds that are not running healing hands. It's implied that if they're running healing hands, they're probably running the, the ward portion of healing hands. 
which is absolutely fine. I, I like it's out there. It's meta. I'm trying to get back up top with something that's not meta at the moment. It's a classic, but it's not meta. Uh, I might switch this up, but at the same time, like the build looks pretty good. We got a devotion with crit strike multi. We got you know, the helmet needs work, but the, the chest plate is pretty much on point. The wand is pretty freaking good. We got a double T six. The only thing is I wish this was a crystal wand if this was a crystal wand this would be this would be best in slot uh reins are okay i i guess i i would this one needs work i need a necrotic rain with throwing attack speed but i don't need the poison resistance this is pretty much a best in slot banner it, it's so boring man you win some, you lose some, Space Trucker. I just wish Arena Runs didn't take so long, because, I mean, I guess we could do, we, we could look for some better gloves. The plus four block chance, though, is, is nice. I did improve my position, but I didn't increase my rank. Actually, let's go see how we're doing on the Primalist leaderboard. Our character on the Primalist leaderboard is Johnny Two Fames. Oh, we got knocked out of the top 10. No. Yeah, we did. I remember I was really salty about this one. Can you see why, chat? If I survived two more waves, I would have jumped. And you want to know what happened? I got one shot. I got one shot by an enemy off screen that I couldn't see on this run. I was salty as fuck. I was hella salty about that. I'm like, how did I die? And then like you go back and look, I'm like, I got shot by something off screen. Like that was the worst feels bad moment. Like, I was doing so good, and then I got shot by something I couldn't even see off screen. And then we ended two waves before this, and we would have jumped so many positions. All right, bike, been a long day, off to bed. Hey, Space Trucker, thanks for being here, man. You've been here for most of the stream, and you're here, like, every day I stream. I really appreciate it, man. You take care. Honestly, I'm not going to lie, Vincent. The the healing hands meta is strong on Sentinel. I'm a little bored with it because you either got to like run smite or you got to run like a melee attack. And then that melee attack's got to be like all of your damage, right? Unless somebody comes up with something because you got to really spec into it. You got to really spec into it and support it. And I'm just a little bored of the healing hands meta. I, I played that Void Knight Rive healing hands build for a week and it was beastie. And I just, I got a little, a, a little fatigued off of it. <sighs> I will say if... If you think you might be into it, you could try rolling since you already probably got a, a number, a, a few pieces of gear for it. You can try rolling that into a, like a rive here. We, we can demonstrate what I'm talking about. All right. So the, the title of the YouTube video is not 100% correct. We're going to play a little bit of void night only because I got them set up for, um, rive healing hands. So let's go knock out a, let's go do like a T4 jewel row, right? Th this build's really good for T for for jewel row. Oh, first I gotta see if prophecies are shared. I don't think they are. That'd be kind of nutty if they are. 
I feel like everybody gets their own prophecies. Pretty sure everybody gets... They're not. Okay, good. I'm like, I, I can't remember now. All right. So... So, here, we're going to do T4. So, you're running Smite Healing Hands. Let me show you Rive Healing Hands. Now, this is this is Void Knight. You're playing on Paladin, but you can still do it. You can still do it on on Paladin. It'll work just fine. You're just not going to get all the echoes, and that's, that's fine. So, if this sort of play style interests you... You can try rolling your build since you probably already got a couple pieces for it. You know, healing, like, plus the healing hands and that sort of thing. Never understood what procced the ward? The, the healing hands is what... Yeah, that's exactly it. Your healing hands is proc in the ward. Here, I, I could show you after... Um, I could show you after we get out of here. So what did you end up using? Did you get the gloves with the experimental affects? last steps yeah last steps is fine but just note that last steps i i've tried it last steps applies chill to you like every couple seconds and chill slows your attack speed Try going up here and down. One problem with the build that I don't like is if you're not attacking, you lose ward. Now, you can invest to try and hold on to that ward as much as possible through ward retention. Okay, here, let me let me demonstrate what what I'm talk what I'm talking about. <sighs> Look, okay, cool. All right, so we're going to go over to healing hands. So we got healing hands right here. Mana cost is zero. Nice. If you look at divine barrier, divine barrier converts all of the healing from healing hands to ward. If you have an item where you lose percent health per second, but gain ward per percent health missing yeah that type thing and then i use a, a cleaver solution to try and retain some of that because it gives us um it gives us intelligence which offers ward retention and you could 
you could do even more. You can do like last steps. You can do uh, the the gloves. Yeah, so that's why it's working for you. Ellie, <laughs> doing Le videos. That's right. Our squirrels build went live yesterday. And it seems like it's decently popular. One thing I also don't really like too much about the, the build is it's a little slow, like in terms of movement. Oh my gosh. And then if you go for long stretches of not encountering an enemy, your ward drops to levels where even with a thousand plus ward, you'll, you'll get one shot. Running four hardcore alts, see which survives best till the new cycle. Whoever wins gets to be my main next cycle. Lost only one so far. Wait, which one did you lose? So yeah, that was T4 Jora. Yeah, yeah. So I just wanted to sh show what what is possible with it. Basically, if I ever need to do a T4 Jora slam, I can do that on Smite. Your your Forge Guard. <laughs> you you lost your Forge Guard. I'm sorry to hear that, man. Could it have happened to a better class? <laughs> get out, get out. All right, let's go looking for apathy. Okay, we got a one LP apathy. We got another one LP apathy. We got another one LP apathy. We got four unique apathies and then we got another one lp apathy okay so which one 90 percent melee damage oh that sounds fun good leech rate decent near max melee void oh what about this one 
low end even lower even lower okay well we found our candidate for the slam chance to apply frailty you know what let's just level that up chance to bleed on hit you know that could be interesting let's go to the suffix we already got one with frailty and armor shred so let's do one with sure we'll, we'll, we'll do that Okay. Here it is. Shaman, Sork, or Warlock are doing well. Excellent. Oh, yeah. All right, chat. We definitely do not want the 18% melee critical strike chance. We do not want that. Secretly, we do. Oh! Get it! Let's go! <laughs> that is a max T7 melee critical strike chance. I didn't think it was going to work, chat. I didn't think it was going to work. Oh my gosh. This thing is nearly max on all of its rolls. This thing is nearly max. Oh. Oh, chat. You already know. We got to do something with this beast. We might resurrect the Master Yi build, chat. We might resurrect the Master Yi build. It won't be the Master Yi build anymore. It'll be, I don't know, the slow ass build. But nonetheless, that Void Cleave is going to hurt gonna hurt yeah well where's my master ye tab if you are in live I would link that in chat <laughs> <laughs> thanks giovanni thank you giovanni uh i i don't always feel like i'm lucky <laughs> nice dude grats <laughs> That is nice. Dude, what if we did like what what spec are you playing? Uh uh
Dude, I'm gonna laugh at this guy's like, yo, you should go check out this this YouTube video. This dude Babley Bike made it. <laughs> this dude babbling bike made a void knight build with it uses that weapon. <laughs> oh wow, that that was a mighty slam. That was a mighty slam indeed, chat. Uh, what we got? What do we get today? Dude, literally no one on my friends list is playing Last Epoch. Alright guys, I'm going to shut her down for today. If you're over here on Twitch, I'm going to send you towards Typical Outlaw. He does stream Last Epoch, but right now he's playing Dragon's Dogma 2. We're just going to send him some love. And uh, yeah, so in the meantime, you guys take care. I will be back again tomorrow. We will be doing more Paladin, even though we finish out the night on Void Night. Anyway, thank you so much for being here, guys. And uh, I will see you guys again tomorrow. Thank you. Bye. All right, YouTube. Thanks for rocking with me today, guys. Yeah, I got to shut things down. G, G, and D. Let's get some GGs in the chat. That's what I'm talking about. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much, YouTube. Thank you so very much. If you guys are on the way out, if you can hit that like button, that'd help a lot. If if not, that's absolutely fine. Appreciate it so much. I'm going to shut things down. I will be back again tomorrow for more Paladin. Have a good night.